Hey man, <laughs> let's go, man. <laughs> Woo! YouTube team, keep it clean. What's going on? It's Engraven here with another video, and in this video, well, let's take it back to the previous video for this morning because we were just talking about a player who reminded me of the offensive version of this guy, but now we got this guy back. Back off of the PUP, Marcus Peters. <laughs> hey, man. Oh, finally, man. Woo! Finally. It, man, shout out to my guy, David, who's out there covering the training camp. He sent me a video of Marcus Peters walk. I said, yes! Back. And it's. We know, man. Hey, a lot of us miss Marcus Peters dearly, dearly because he just, there's nobody on the squad like MP Juice, man. It's nobody. Nobody. Um, and it's such a, a beautiful thing for him to be back in the building. Ravens done activated him off the PUP list, so he's back practicing. Now, of course, he, he's not going to play in the game against the Cardinals, but this is great timing. My, my guy, uh, Meech, he hit me up and he said, hey, timing is everything. Because we were just doing the videos talking about if we should be worried about Marcus Peters. And y'all know I said, yeah, yeah, because we hadn't heard nothing. But then my guy David and my guy Cal gave me updates on Marcus Peters. And then I had to share those updates that they gave me with Team Keep It Clean. And it was like, woo. Sigh of relief And they were like Alright hey, MP's supposed to return In uh, about mid-August Guess what day it is The 15th So we're literally right in the middle of August I know it's 31 days So I guess the 15th at 12pm uh, at Would be right in dead center In the middle of August But he's back Marcus Peters is back So those reports were accurate Spot on And it's I love it I love it so, <sighs> oh, that, man, it, 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 I'm so happy, man. Like, Marcus Peters is like, um, he, he one of my favorite players on the team just because of just what he does, man, and how he does it, how he conducts himself, how he handles his business. I love it. So, yes. Now, see? The good news didn't stop there because somebody else who we hadn't been hearing nothing about. Nothing. Because we talked about how, man, Ravens got a lot of depth in the secondary. Man, Ravens got so much depth, especially at the safety position. And when we mentioned safeties, we would talk Marcus Williams. We would talk Kyle Hamilton. We would talk Chuck Clark. We would talk Tony Jefferson. We would talk Geno Stone. We would even talk Brandon Stevens. Even though we expect him to do a little mix of both. But one guy that we talked about a little bit, but just really hadn't heard anything else on, was our Darius Washington undrafted rookie from last year. And we know he played a little bit, then I think he ended up breaking his foot. And then hadn't heard anything since. That ended his season prematurely, and then that was that. It was expected that he may play safety, but he also may play slot corner. So now... He also returned to practice. Ardarius Washington, welcome back. Welcome back. This is such a, uh, such a beautiful day. I mean, every day is a beautiful day because it's another opportunity to do something good and do something positive. Um, but today, as far as being a Ravens fan, this is a beautiful thing. Because guys are just, they're coming back. They're coming back. Um, somebody else who returned to practice was Justin Matabike. Um, I hadn't even realized that he had been out of practice. He had been missing practices. Uh, but also J.K. Dobbins. And we know he came back officially a couple days ago, but then they held him out Saturday and Sunday. He said that was, that was a little precautionary thing. Hey, hey, no problem. Hey, Ravens, Ravens, Ravens. Take all the precautionary steps that you want to. I, I guarantee you. A lot, Ravens fans don't agree on a lot of stuff. But I guarantee you, that will be one thing that every single Ravens fan will agree on, that they have no problem with the Ravens being extra cautious this season. I guarantee you, 
But, you know, anyway, there's still going to be something. They'll be like, no, get them guys out there, buddy. But it's, it, it, is, it is what it is. Um, now, a uh, little side note. Um, today was, uh, it. well, tomorrow is the deadline um, for the Ravens to get down to 85 men on the roster. For, for all teams to get down to 85 men on the roster. Um, so the Ravens, they got started. And the cuts that they made were linebacker Chuck Wiley um, and also cornerback number 17, Robert Jackson. Um, now, we know we remember Robert Jackson from last season. Uh, we remember him from the infamous uh, Packers game where Ravens played a defense that I've never seen in the history of defenses before. Um, it was crazy defense that they played on Devontae Adams. Um, then we remember, of course, that was it the outside slant? I think it was the outside slant or. I think it was the outside slant. No, maybe it was. No, I think it was the inside slant that Devante Adams run, but Robert Jackson went outside. Um, and he, it, it was a miscommunication with him and the safety. I forgot what, exactly what it was. But anyway, Robert Jackson was also uh, released from the Baltimore Ravens. Um, and he, yeah, he came through last year and obviously an injury riddled year. Secondary was absolutely demolished with injuries. And he just tried to fill in, and it was definitely a struggle. It was a struggle. Um, but the Ravens have released him. And, of course, um, a couple days ago, they had released uh, Devin Williams, the undrafted wide receiver from Oregon, and also, oh, is it Kevin Williams? Oh, no, not, it wasn't Kevin Williams. It was, a, it was a cornerback who was another undrafted guy this year. Um, so the Ravens have been, they, they've, they've been starting the process. Um, who's next? Who knows? We, we don't know. Um, but yeah, man, it's, uh, it's, it's going to be a process. I think, um, how many do they have on the roster now? I don't even know, but by tomorrow, then Ravens will be down to, uh, 85 players. So anyway, or is it 80? Oh no, no. 85, 85, okay, 85. Okay. They at 90 right now. Well, they were at 90, but they got to get down to 85. So they may actually just need to cut, I think, maybe one more person. Because they cut Devin Williams and, and the other Williams. They cut Robert Jackson. And um, they cut Robert Jackson. And uh, now I forgot the, guy, the, the linebacker's name. Um, so they may need to just cut one more person. Or, may, or did that get them down to 85 already? I don't know. Either way, we'll see. And when we confirm whether they get to 85 or not, then we'll, of course, let you know. But that boy Juice Man is back. So just like the opposite of Juice Man, I'm out.